They're just putting all this stuff in a cookie cutter system. This is who you call, this is what you say, this is what you do, and it's the same for everybody, and it's BS. What's going on, guys? Welcome to the Value Vault episode series. Today, this is episode 12. We are here with the mentor, the real estate legend, Ricky Carruth. Not only is he a baller and a boss when it comes to real estate sales, selling 100 plus properties a year as a single agent in the past five years, absolutely crushing the real estate industry. But now he's taking a new approach and really started to modify and impact the real estate industry with his coaching and his and his expertise and his knowledge. So Ricky, I'm so appreciative of you taking the time to get on this value vault with me and really impacting the real estate world. So thank you for coming on. Dude, I am all about it. I'm so excited to be here, bro. This is going to be incredible, man. Just everybody watching, like sit down and get ready. This is going to get wild. Absolutely, because you are the, the free real estate coach and you have so much knowledge and information to spare to this world. So many people talk so highly of you and learn from you and so many people's business really scales to the next level because of your of your intro and information and the tips and tricks that you provide, whether it's on YouTube and on Instagram. I'm going to leave all of Ricky's information at the end of this video and of course in the beginning where you can find him. But uh, Ricky, you know, today... I really wanted to get you on here so you can share with my audience and of course everyone watching and all the viewers one piece of value that is going to change one's real one's, one's real estate career, one's real estate business. And we were talking and I, and I know that you really want to, you're, you're passionate when it comes to reverse engineering the real estate career, right? So yeah. how can you reverse engineer the real estate career? Well man, look, I'm just going to take a deep breath and just let it all out real quick, okay? Here we go. So the first thing you got to figure out is what do you want out of a real estate career? What is your end goal? How do you want it all to play out? Do you want to get to a million a year? Do you want to sell half a million a year? Do you want to impact so many people? You know, what exactly, what's your why as far as real estate goes, right? So you got to figure out what that end game is so that you can reverse engineer how to get to that end game, okay? So that's the first step is to figure out exactly where the end game is so that, that we can figure out how to reverse engineer it. Then. We're going to understand all the mindset principles that I've learned in my 17 years of becoming a millionaire at 23, losing it all by 25, and reading 100 books and studying the market, which is closings continue to happen every day regardless of market conditions. Business is unlimited for everybody forever, and you always, always have to value relationships over transactions. Okay, that's the three key principles right there. It's a mindset. Once you put these three things together and then act on these three things as far as communicating who you are as a person that you really care about people and share that with many, many people, a volume of people. The problem is, even if you understand what I'm saying, you, you get caught up in just a few clients and it clogs you up and you can't you kind of stop trying to get the message out there even further about who you are. See, everybody, most agents out there are really good people. They mean well. They work hard. They, they're dependable. Everything that everybody wants an agent to be, most agents are actually that kind of agent. The problem is they haven't learned because of traditional coaching and all the mainstream coaching and all the stuff out there, all the distractions, Nobody's really teaching agents how to communicate who they are as a person that they care about people with their prospects. They're just putting all this stuff in a cookie cutter system. This is who you call. This is what you say. This is what you do. And it's the same for everybody. And it's BS, right? Every agent has a different personality and every prospect has a different situation. So how can every single situation be the same and have the same protocol for how you follow up, how you convert, how you talk to them and all everything else? It, it's it, 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 it's total BS. And so what I'm doing is I'm reversing engineering the entire industry right now. I'm in mid I'm in mid engineer. And what I'm doing is, is I'm spreading the message of it's not about do you want to buy or sell? Have you considered moving and who do you know? Right. It's about what in the world can I do for you? And then I'm focusing everything on the answer to that question. And by going deep with what can I do for you, and then if they want to do something, 
It's like, is there an agent you would work with if you were to do something, or, or is there an agent you're going to work with on that? That way you kind of put it out on Front Street, is there room for a relationship with me as an agent to prospect relationship? And if so, let's continue further here and find out why they want to buy or sell. Did their mom die? Kids go to college? Did they lose a job? Get a job? Relocating is an investment. What are they doing? Why are they doing it? Because it's something bigger than just buying or selling a piece of property. Something's going on in their life that's bigger than the piece of property. And when you when you when you go down this road of what in the world can I do for you? Is there an agent you're going to work with? And why do you want to do what you're going to do? You go so deep with the relationship and you still haven't asked them if they want to buy or sell something. But here you are and you've created a real relationship with a real human being in your market that is going to do something. And who are they going to use? Not the agent that said, do you want to buy something? Will you sign this? Let's go here. Here and try to force them into some awkward situations. No, they're going to use you because you actually cared about what was going on with them uh, and you took the time with them to actually show them and communicate that you cared by using your personality to show them that you cared, right? And then from there, the conversion is automatic. When you, when you connect first, then convert, the conversion is, is, there's no conversion. Like the conversion has already happened right before your very eyes. Everybody's trying to convert before they connect. They're trying to call people they don't know, and they're trying to say, hey, have you thought about selling? Have you thought about moving? You know, it's like, you don't know me. I don't know you. I could be a scam artist, but will you tell me everything about your financial future and what you're planning on doing and all that stuff? And if not, if you can't help me by buying or selling something and making me a commission, who do you know? You know, I'm done with you. Show me who you, you might know that could help me. I'm just here for me. I just want you to help me some, some way, somehow, right? It's just, it's just backwards, and agents don't understand that this is what's going inside their head, sublimity, and so they don't understand that what they're saying, it, it goes, it's so deep, because if you take that same prospect and you say, what in the world can I do for you as an agent you would work with, why do you want to do whatever, what happens is, is that prospect, everybody's so short-term minded, dude, that prospect turns into 10 to 20 deals to you over the life of your career through repeat business referrals and referrals of referrals, right? And so when you understand this, like it, it goes so much deeper because when you're talking to so many people to try to, to try to connect and you're connecting with all these people, it's okay to not care if that person wants to buy or sell something today, next month, next year, 10 years from now, because you understand that closings happen every day. And if you're doing what you're supposed to do to talk to enough people, you know, and that's your job is to connect with as many people as you can, you're going to run into people who want to do stuff today, buy and sell stuff right now, right? It's, it's, it's inevitable. So it's going to happen. So through the process of having faith, that you can look in your MLS and go back even through the worst times in 2005, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and see that closings were still happening every single day in your market, then nothing else matters. A huge weight is lifted off your shoulders and now you can breathe knowing that it doesn't matter if the market crashes, it doesn't matter what happens, you have job security forever if you learn how to develop the skill of communicating who you are as a person with everybody in the world. I need a mic to drop. <laughs> that was awesome. I can't agree with you more. Like, what I took out of that is you just need to simply communicate with people. And I love what you said before. You said communicate or connect over convert. Yeah. I love it so much. And it's so true. Yeah. And that's, that's the concept that so many people kind of just surpass and they just go, well, how do I get the money out of right. the transaction? And, and I, I, I can't agree with you more. You need to understand the people's, the, the people's goals. What are their goals? You don't know if they're looking for a rental, long-term, short-term investment property. Someone died exactly like you said before. What is that situation? Because then, yeah. at that point, you can go completely haywire with this transaction if you don't know your client's goals. You know, we know your goal as a realtor is to get that money. Yes, sure. But like, what else? Mm -hmm. Get that connection because if only converting that one deal is your goal, you probably lost out on a ton of other deals because of that deal. That could have probably gone to X amount of more deals if that communication and connection was made on a deeper level. All of a sudden, you actually care about my goals and care about what my vision is with this property. I'm going to connect you with Sally. She's my friend. I'm going to connect you with Joe. He's my cousin. And on and on. So, like, I totally agree. Connect or convert. 
I love that so much. Oh man, that was a good piece of value. I'm, I, I'm definitely sure that some of these realtors watching this and real estate <laughs> professionals are going to take that. So guys, just to recap of that value of this valuable episode is connect over convert. Try to connect with your, your clients, build a unique relationship with them and actually care about what their goals are over yours. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, that's going to build a beautiful relationship. So again, Ricky, thank you for dropping some fire. Yes. Yes. I'm so excited. (laughs) Guys, if you are not following Ricky, please give him a follow on all social medias, Instagram, YouTube, Pinterest, wherever you're at, Ricky. Lead it away. Where are you? Where can the people find you? Dude, I, I feel like Instagram and YouTube is my biggest two platforms right now. I have an incredibly uh, large Facebook group um, full of all my coaching students. The coaching program, ZeroToDiamond.com, is over 11,000 agents and growing by 50 to 100 a day. It's the fastest growing real estate coaching program out there. We're literally changing the world. I'm getting emails every day from agents that were going to have to quit until they found me somewhere. They started applying my principles and now they're crushing it. And it just makes me want to like lay down in a ball and just get in a fetal position and start crying, dude, because it's so it's such an emotional thing, man, because it's it's helping so many people and we really are changing the world. And so I'm just excited about the future of you know watching you grow and the future of Zero to Diamond and I'm speaking all over the, the world and everything. And you know, if I come to a city near you guys, please just reach out to me. I answer every single DM. I spend an hour or two every day on DM answering every single question and problem and comments and everything that I can do to to give back. Why do I do that? Because I really do care about you and I don't want a dollar from you. So please reach out. Let me know what I can do to help you. And um, go to zerodiamond.com and sign up for the free coaching and join the 11,000 strong. And let's, let's go. Let's go. I love it. Zero to Diamond. That's epic. Ricky, thank you so much for coming on this show with me for this episode. I am more than sure that the realtors are going to convert with you and connect with you because you have so much value to provide and that's so important at the end of the day is provide value and make an impact impact over income and right here is what your goal is and that is who you are sounds like a free coaching oh man that's that's amazing who doesn't want that right so again now thank you so much for coming on and remember remember today is a great day to be great let's, go. let's do it <laughs>